We have some new information coming in from Washington today on that incident on board an Alaska Airlines Boeing 737 MAX 9. The video right there, it's when that door plug blew out in mid-flight. The NTSB saying today Boeing has not fully cooperated with their investigation. ABC's Zareen Shah has that story. Today, troubling testimony from the NTSB after a door plug fell off an Alaska Airlines Boeing 737 MAX 9 plane in the middle of a flight back in January. Speaking in front of the Senate Commerce Committee, NTSB Chair Jennifer Homendi saying Boeing has not fully cooperated with their investigation. Boeing has not provided us with the documents and information that we have requested numerous times over the past few months, specifically with respect to opening, closing, and removal of the door, and the team that does that work at the Renton facility. She says the manager of the team that works on doors has been on medical leave, preventing the agency from being able to conduct an interview. And despite requesting names of the 25 people on the team, Boeing has not handed over that information. It's absurd that two months later, we don't have that. The chair saying she believes Boeing typically keeps documents when work on door plugs are conducted. Either they exist and we don't have them, or they do not exist, which raises two very different questions, several different questions. The preliminary NTSB report stated that the four bolts that were made to prevent the door from falling were not there when the flight took off. Reports showed rivets on the door plug were replaced last September and the door was removed. The plug was closed with no visible bolts in three different places, according to a photo that Boeing shared with the NTSB. Boeing saying in a statement today they have given a list of everyone on the 737 door team to the NTSB. As for the documents, Boeing statement says if the door plug removal was undocumented, there would be no documentation to share. Zorin Shah, ABC News, Los Angeles.